Hello everybody, this is Sean here with GLE. I am here at Times Square with... Jessica. And... Julia. Nice to meet you both. What are we doing here today? On vacation. Yeah, on vacation. On vacation for a weekend. Where are you from? New Jersey. Where in New Jersey are you from? North Jersey. Where is that? New Providence, Parsippany. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay, cool. So, what have you guys done today so far? We went to the Wax Museum, Ripley's Believe It or Not, and uh, Dallas Barbecue. Any exciting plans for the evening? That's actually what we're just talking about right now. We may go to the Hard Rock to eat. Where? The Hard Rock. Oh, Cafe. very cool, very cool. Yeah. So, we've spent the past year, I know you don't want to talk about COVID, so we're not going to, but we spent the past year not really being able to do everything that we normally are used to doing. Yeah. So with this newfound freedom, what do you guys plan on doing in the future? Are you excited for the summer? Any big plans? Yes, concerts and sporting events, hockey games, all of that. She agrees. Goddamn right. <laughs> what about you? Anything that you've been craving to do all this time that you finally can do once things get better? Well, I'm honestly a nature girl, so I'm always outside in the woods or going to hockey games with this one. So, yeah. So, if you're a nature girl, then this past year must not have been that difficult for you. No. I go for walks all the time, take pictures of animals, stuff like that. Would you consider yourself more of an introvert? Yeah. Are you more extroverted? Yes. Okay, so you balance each other out. Yes. What's the relationship here? Girlfriend. Girlfriend, yeah. How'd you guys meet? Work. Oh, really? What do you guys do? Security and EMS. Which yeah. one's security? Which one's EMS? We're both. Oh, oh okay. She's more uh, EMS, though. Yeah. She's better at that. What is it for? For a nursing home. Okay, very yeah. cool. Yeah. Oh, nursing homes. Those were hit hard. Oh, sorry, yeah, sorry, sorry. We don't no, want to okay. like no, talk about that. They were hit hard, though. <laughs> okay, so Cuomo is getting a lot of shit lately because of the whole nursing home thing and then the whole sex scandal. How do we feel about Cuomo and the way he's been handling everything? Sex scandal is just a piece of shit, honestly. That's just my opinion. Get him Tell out. Tell how it is. <laughs> That's what I think. Just get him out. Anytime sex scandal, just fucking go away. <laughs> Are you girls into social media at all? Yes. Yeah? Yeah. Uh, yes, I am. Do you go on TikTok? I do. So this past year with people not having so much to do, I feel like TikTok has become really freaking huge. Mm -hmm. Do you feel like this is a positive or a negative thing? I think it's positive to a point because people are having fun with it and they're able to be with their friends and family and make fun videos during this time. So I think it's mainly positive. Okay, cool. Yeah, no, I would agree. I, I would say that TikTok sets itself apart from a lot of other more image-based social media apps. Mm -hmm. But it seems like everybody's trying to be a star. Do you think that that can get kind of out of hand? Yes, I definitely do because everyone's trying to get all the million views. It's literally so crazy. I actually can't believe it. Actually, around here, you wouldn't believe how many TikTok stars we get every day. I mean, listen, I'm on that too, you know? I'm trying to get yeah. my own followers, yes. but I think it could get out of hand. Um, recently, they've linked high social media use to higher levels of narcissism. Narcissism. Do you agree with that? Yes. 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 <laughs> Hell yeah. A lot Do of you... people are narcissistic when they make TikToks and shit like that. It's all about them. So. so you think I'm a narcissist for making no, TikTok? not at all, no, because my girlfriend does it all the fucking time, so not her either. Would you, but I feel like if you're doing what you do for a living, you probably have higher levels of empathy overall, I would say, right? Yeah, I would say. Okay, so no narcissism here? No. Okay, so just in case I say anything wrong, I don't have to be afraid that you're going to like come to my bed at night and no. find out where I live. No, and no, no, no. Okay, great. <laughs> well, thank you, ladies. You were a pleasure to talk thank to. I hope you, you have a great rest of your night. This is Sean with GLE signing off.